CIET NCERT presents audiobook of mathematics for class 5 entitled Math Magic 5. This is the chapter 7. Part 1. Page 99. Can you see the pattern? This page has a series of pictures where Isha and her friend are talking to each other. The friend tells Isha, Isha, your skirt is beautiful. To which Isha replies, My mother made this pattern. The friend says, I have seen the same block making a different pattern on a kurta. Isha says, How was it different? The friend explains, in your skirt, the rule of the pattern is one up, one down. Then this is repeated. But in my brother's kurta, it is once up, then takes a one-fourth turn every time. The rule is to repeat it with a one-fourth clockwise turn. Above and below this dialogue, shown as a picture, we see a series of the rules of patterns the friend has just explained. One up, one down, and then once up, and then a one-fourth turn clockwise. Now, you use these two rules to make patterns with this block. There is a block as a flower on leaves shown in the form of a small picture. Also, make your own rule for the teacher. In Math Magic Class 4, page 107 to 108, children have seen how one motif is used in three different ways. And in Class 3, page 145, the same sequence of motifs is repeated. Discuss how the motif here turns clockwise. Page 100 Turns and Patterns We have a block with us with magenta color flower on a couple of green leaves. Observe this block. We make three different rules to turn it clockwise and see the patterns. Rule 1. Repeat it with a one-fourth turn. There is a series of pictures below this indicating how this one-fourth turn repeat takes place. Rule 2. Repeat it with a half turn. Below this again we have a series of pictures indicating this half turn repeat. Rule 3. Repeat it with a three-fourth turn. And again we have a series of pictures where this block is repeated with a three-fourth turn. Practice time. 1. What should come next? A. We see a circular pattern rotating in a particular way. Three instances have been given. You have to create two more instances based on this repeat. B. We see the letter N again repeating with half turn. Three instances of this repeat are shown. Two blank spaces are provided for you to draw the pattern. For the teacher, encourage children to think of other alternatives. Answers obtained by anti-clockwise turns should also be accepted and discussed. Page 101. C. We again see a pattern of a triangle rotating in a particular way. Three instances have been shown. Two blank spaces are provided for you to fill up. D. We have a circle block this time with a square inside. The repeat rule is again following a particular pattern. Three instances of movement are given here. Two more have to be drawn by you. 2. See this pattern. A. We see the letter F following a rule of repeat by some particular rotation. 
Four instances are given. One space is blank for you to fill up. The rule of the pattern is turning by 45 degrees each time. Which will be the next? Tick mark the right one. Three different options have been given. Using the same rule, take it forward till you get back to what you started with. B. The letter L is shown following a rule of the pattern, turning at a particular angle. Two instances are shown. Eight more instances have to be drawn by you. C. The letter P this time follows the same pattern. Again, two instances have been shown and eight more are to be drawn by you. Page 102 3. Some patterns are given below on the left side of the red line. For each pattern, write the rule. Then choose what comes next from the right side of the line and tick it. There is a red line drawn vertically in the middle. On both sides of it we have some patterns. A. Three pictures of a block show the rule which you have to write down in the space provided. And you have to choose what comes next from the right options. B. A kite-like pattern is shown again as three instances. Identify the rule and write it down in the blank space. Also, choose what would be the next instance from the two choices given on the right. Tick mark the correct one. C. A typical pattern is shown again following a repeat pattern. Identify the rule of the pattern and write it down in the blank space provided. Also choose what would be the next repeat from the two options given on the right by tick marking the right one. D. A spiral-like pattern is shown. Four instances are enough to make you clear about the rule the pattern is following. Identify it and write it down in the blank space given. Also choose what will be the next repeat pattern from out of the two choices given on the right by ticking the correct one. Page 103 Look for a pattern. Mark that picture which is breaking the rule. Also, correct it. We have four parts, A, B, C and D, with different pictures, all of them following a pattern rule. You have to identify the one which is breaking the rule and then try and correct it. Magic squares. Do you remember magic triangles? Come now, let's make some magic squares. Fill this square using all the numbers from 46 to 54. Rule, the total of each line is 150. We have a square grid with three columns and three rows. Numbers between 46 and 54 have been written. The numbers written are 46, 47, 49 and 52. Now you have to fill in the rest of the square following the rule that total of each line should be 150. Below this we have another square with three rows and three columns. Number 25 is written in the middle. Fill this square using all the numbers from 21 to 29. Rule, the total of each side is 75. For the teacher, you can see Math Magic Class 4, page 11 for similar magic patterns. Part 1 Chapter 7 Ends Here Narrator, Gaurav Marva Assistance in Production by Soumya Malik Producer Vimlesh Chaudhary Presented by CIET NCERT New Delhi, India